Hey, welcome back. Today we're going to talk about adding a background and a foreground to your animation. Now, in traditional animation, cell animation, they would have the cells or the action on a clear piece of paper, and the backgrounds would be on a separate board that would get shot underneath the cell. The reason for that is you don't want to have to redraw the same background hundreds and hundreds of times because then it has to be exactly the same hundreds and hundreds of times, not to mention all the work of redrawing the same background over and over and over again. So in Procreate, you can have a background that you don't have to redraw over and over again. And I'm gonna show you how to do that today. I'm also gonna show you how to add a foreground to the picture, something in the front of the action that you want in every frame and you don't wanna do it over and over again. Now, normally you might do this in the beginning um, before you've done any animation, but this is a short animation I did a while ago. It looks like this. And maybe I want to have some trees in the background. To do that, I'm going to add a frame. Now the frame is going to get stuck right now in the middle of this first section of the animation. I'm going to tap and hold it and drag it to the beginning of the animation. And this is gonna be my background. So I'm gonna tap the actual frame itself and pull up this menu. And I'm gonna say background. Now that is set as my background. So now I'm gonna draw my background into the scene. So maybe there's a tree over here. And you can see it's going behind the animation action. I'm just gonna do it in a style that matches the animation that's already here. And now if I didn't have the background setting, I have to redraw that tree over and over again. But because I set that frame to be the background, when I hit play, that tree is automatically inserted into every frame and now it's part of the animation. Now, like I said, you can do the same thing with something in front of the action. So I'm gonna to go to the end of my animation and this frame would go at the end of the animation. So I'm gonna add a frame, I'm gonna tap it and I'm gonna call that the foreground. So now in the foreground, maybe there's a um, small tree right here or another tree. I'm going to just add a branch coming out or down that would go over the snowman, which I'd probably take out in a real animation like this, but I just want to show where it is that it will stay in every frame. So if I hit play, now I have my foreground and my background, both in every frame. I only had to draw them once, thanks to the foreground and background setting. If you have any ideas for future tutorials in Procreate, leave them in the comments. Thanks for subscribing, ringing that bell, liking this video. I'll see you next time.